Two senior pollsters are now suggesting Scottish independence is becoming increasingly likely, so with the breakup of the UK seeming more likely now than it did a year ago, today Express readers are being asked, are you worried? Both former Ipsos Mori boss Mark Diffley, and Sir John Curtis, professor of politics at the University of Strathclyde, have spoken out in recent days to highlight what they said was a sustained trend. Last week a panel-based poll of 1,026 Scottish voters suggested 54% of Scots would back yes in another independence referendum, whilst support for no stood at 46%. Commenting, former Ipsos Mori boss Mark Diffley said support for independence, as backed by Scotland's First Minister and SNP leader Nicola Sturgeon, was more than a flash in the pan. Speaking on Tuesday, he told a webinar for the John Smith Centre hosted by former Scottish Labour leader Kezia Dugdale, previous no voters, who voted to stay in the UK but also wanted to stay within the EU, are moving more to yes. Of course it does go the other way, people who voted for an independent Scotland who also voted for Brexit, some would rather now be in the UK outside of Europe. But that first group is much larger. Mr. Diffley added, what is quite interesting is that if we bookend this, immediately after the EU referendum, the weekend after, there were two or three polls that suggested support for independence had gone up. But that didn't last, it was almost a knee-jerk reaction to what had happened in the Brexit vote. But we are now starting to see a pattern emerging from enough polls to suggest this is not just a blip. That's something a little more significant, both in the number of polls and the level of support and in terms of the length of time, this has been noticeable for a good six to eight months now. Speaking at the weekend, Professor Curtis said, never before have the foundations of public support for the union looked so weak. Our latest poll from Panelbase confirms other recent polling that has suggested those who intend to vote yes in a second independence referendum have nudged ahead.